What brought Charles Dalshaw, a Prussian immigrant, to Texas soon after Europe's year of failed revolutions, 1848? I dare not say. The truth is we know too little on the man. Arriving in Galveston, aged 19, he trained to be a butcher. We know in 1861, now in his early 30s, he married a young widow with a five-year-old girl and started a family of his own. To his debit, he signed up to serve on the losing side of the American Civil War. Post-war, he worked at a butchery in Richmond, Texas, and brought his family up, but would see his wife and almost all his children pass before him. But his stepdaughter lived on a while. She moved out to Houston, Texas, married a saddle maker, and reared a family of her own. In the early 1890s, Charles took up a job as a clerk for his stepson-in-law's business, and when the saddle maker passed on suddenly, he moved into his stepdaughter's house to help bring up the kids. By 1899, Charles Delshaw was officially retired. Needing a hobby, he decided to write, paint, and collage his memoirs. Though he probably filled a total of 22 books, a series of 12 of these books are still in existence. From 1899 till his death in 1923, aged 93, he whiled away most of his days working in his stepdaughter's attic, 